Hello chess lovers, let's have a look at a game played by Mikhail Botvinnik and Mikhail Yudovich. The game was played in 1933 in Leningrad. Botvinnik started with c4, knight f6 by black, d4, g6, knight c3, d5, this is the Grunfeld defense, knight f3, bishop g7, queen b3, this is the Russian variation of Grunfeld defense c6, a rare move, usually in this position black is taking on c4, but we see c6, c takes d5, knight takes d5, bishop b2, black castles, e4, knight b6, and rook d1. Indirectly white is defending the pawn on d4. Well, if you take on d4, then after knight takes d4, queen takes d4, bishop h6, black is in trouble. Let's go back. After rook d1, black played knight d7. This is a very dubious move. A better move is bishop e6 or bishop g4. But we see this knight d7 move, which blocks the bishop diagonal. And also, these knights look so misplaced. White played a4, threatening a5, a5 by black, bishop e3. In some cases, white can play d5 attacking the knight on b6 queen c7 bishop e2 queen d6 knight a2 not allowing queen b4 move e6 white castles h6 rook c1 preventing any possible c5 move by black f5 knight c3 King h7, well, instead of playing king h7, it would have been better to play f4. If bishop d2, then bishop takes d4. Rook fd1, bishop g7, g3, f takes g3, h takes g3. This variation would have been better for black, though, of course, white has a slight advantage. But let's go back. We see king h7 move. Now comes rook fd1, f takes e4, knight takes e4. Queen b4, offering an exchange of queens, queen c2, queen takes a4, b3, queen a3, and knight h4. Botvinnik spotted that this diagonal is weakened, and now he's going to use the weakness of this diagonal and attack black king. Queen e7, a bad move. This allows white to go for a very beautiful tactical combination. Can you find that move? In this position, Botvinnik played knight takes g6, sacrificing the knight. Black took on g6, and now another amazing move. Did you find this move? Bishop h5 check. And in this position, black resigned. Well, if you take on h5, then after knight g3 check, king g4, queen e4 check, rook f4, white is simply checkmating. And if your king retreats back, then knight g5 double check, king g8 and queen h7 checkmate. This much. Your comments and questions, please. And thanks for watching. Good luck.